Seeing Sarah in a wheelchair may automatically make one assume this is a story about how she overcame a disability. It is and it isn't. Sarah does have a neuromuscular disease she has been fighting since the age of 13. I was freaking out because I went online and, and did a bunch of research and, and things weren't really that optimistic. But Sarah was. I didn't really have a choice. It was, it was something I had to deal with. And so I just be positive about it and, you know, enjoy life instead of being depressed. Sarah has since gone on to be a standout among the Muscular Dystrophy Association. She is the face of her local MDA's Shamrock program. And they're always there, you know, if I, if I need anything like wheelchairs or walkers or whatever, they're always there and also for emotional support. The same way Sarah is now there for others. She recently hosted a toy drive for children in Mazatlan, Mexico. Her boyfriend, who volunteers in Mazatlan, told her that many children there have nothing to play with. And I told my church about it, I told my school, and I didn't really expect to get all that much, but we were like overwhelmed with donations. Sarah collected dozens of soccer balls, basketballs, and stuffed animals and hand delivered them to Mexico. It's a really good feeling because um, after you rely so much on other people to help you and for you to actually be able to give back, it, it really feels good. And for that, we are proud to call Sarah a moated big kid. Knowing that you can improve someone's life and, and make them happy is like the best feeling ever.